Hapa ndiko alikozaliwa na kulewa Acheng ambalo sio jina lake kamili. Mambo yalianza kumwendea Mrama baada ya marehemu mamake kuaga dunia na kumwacha akiwa na umri wa miaka 16 peke yake. Suluhu likawa ni kuolewa kwenye ndoa ambayo haikudumu japo alifanikiwa na watoto wawili. Kitega uchumi chake sasa ni ukahaba. Acheng mwenye umri wa miaka 27 anasimulia safari yake na dawa ya kuzuia maambukizi ya ukimwi almarufu kama pre exposure prophylaxis ukipenda prep started sex work in 2010 way back uh, being uh, that i started sex work i saw that uh, my life was like in jeopardy when i heard there was uh, this drug called prep at lvc tivoli that was the first time i heard of this prep but the initial name at the bottle was truvada and uh, i decided to give it a try because uh, i thought it could help me as i do my job there were some tests that were supposed to be done and these tests were done and i was disqualified because i i couldn't start it immediately because i had uh, hepatitis b akaweka kwenye matibabu kwa mwaka mzima ndipo sakapata kibali cha dawa hiyo anayoinywa kila siku leo hii hachagui wala kubagua anayetaka kushiriki na mahaba Aside from PrEP, it's good to use condom in combination of PrEP uh, for you to prevent all these opportunities, diseases like STIs, STDs. Jen Nye alizaliwa na virusi vya ukimu miaka 20 iliyopita kabla ya mamake kuwa gadunia. Shangazio alimficha kusia na hali yake hadi magonjwa kama vile kifua kikuu yalipuanza kumsua sua akiwa shuleni ambapo alipimwa kagundua likuwa na virusi vya ukimu kama ningeva shati ya, ya one of my cousin ama ata saa mtu alikuwa ananiambia mtu yani aunt yangu alikuwa anaambia huyo nini my cousin hapana ufai kuvaa huyo atakufanya nini atakupea virusi kama plate nilikuwa nimepewa kikombe yangu sani yangu kijiko yangu Jen alikuwa amekata shauri ya kusonga mbele na maisha Yeye ni mwenyekiti wa kundi la vijana wanaotoa mafunzo kuhusiana na maambukizi ya virusi vya ukimwi katika kaunti ya Kisumu. Mchumba wake ambaye amekuwa nguzo yake baada ya jamaa zake kumtelekeza hata hivyo hana virusi vya ukimwi. So mimi kimeza Elvis zangu vizuri viral yangu iwe sawa na ye ameze prep yake tuko sawa. James mwanamume na ishiriki tendo la ngono na wanaume wenzake alipata virusi vya ukimwi miaka miwili iliyopita akiwa kidato cha tatu mjini Mombasa kilichoanza kama urafiki na mwenzake aliyefahamika kama Mohamed kiligeuka na kuwa penzi hatari na wale ambao wako positive to maintain kumeza dawa cuz hiyo dawa ndio sawa maisha yako sasa hivi ambayo unaangalia hapo mbeleni Dawa ya pre-exposure prophylaxis huwa kwa aina mbili, yani ile ya kumeza kila siku alimradi mtu yuko kwenye hatari ya kuambukizwa virusi hivyo au prep na kuna ile ya kumeza kwenye kipindi cha saa 72 wakati mwathiriwa anapokuwa kwenye hatari ya kuambukizwa virusi hivyo yani PEP. Wataalamu wanasema kwamba PrEP itafanya kazi kikamilifu iwapo itamezwa siku saba kabla ya kushiriki tendo la ngono na mtu anayeishi na virusi vya ukimwi au usiemjua hali yake ya HIV. We need a array of biomedical interventions for boys we are talking about circumcision whose uh, uh, effectiveness is long term. Um, we are talking about being on treatment if you are positive and those who particularly are considered to be most at risk then the additional uh, interventions and that includes prep Kenya inapojiunga na mataifa mengine kwenye maadhimisho ya siku ya ukimwi duniani baada kuikiwa ni step up for HIV prevention youth na plan idadi kubwa ya wanarika walio kwenye hatari ya kuambukizwa virusi vya ukimwi watalazimika kuwa ange kuhusiana na manufaa ya prep sisi wa kesho KT news kutoka kaunti ya Kisumu